a very nostalgic day today. I'm chasing from my hometown, visiting family, so it's it's fun, very nostalgic. Big cell forming over Danville, Illinois right now. Uh, it's moving due east, so I'm gonna go to Crawfordsville, maybe near Alamo, kind of that area. You can see the uh, screenshot right here. It shows the cell forming on the, the border of the state. There's enough instability along this MCV. Uh, I'm gonna go intercept it. Maybe it'll produce some pretty clouds and if it doesn't do anything, I'm hoping that some more stuff will form along the cold front just to the north because the HRRR has been very consistent showing plenty of hailers and with almost two inches of precipitable water, the threat of a wet microburst today is pretty high. So maybe we'll intercept a storm that was like the one that hit Bloomington and I will redeem myself. Gosh, that is green and dark. I'm just south of uh, New Market, uh, Indiana, which is a little bit south of Crawfordsville. You got this huge HP ground scraping storm just to my west northwest holy crap it is green it is beautiful and it's only a marginal risk i might get the retribution that i deserve for missing the storm in bloomington earlier this week but huge non-rotating wall cloud right here it is just monstrous and i found a bean field which means i can see it and i gotta make sure my hair doesn't stand up and in because the lightning is pretty bad wow <laughs> What the heck? Some big motion off to my left. Big motion right there. Real big motion. Look at that. I do not feel safe right now. Look at that rain shaft. Freaking awesome. Awesome stuff. Whew. This thing is turning into a big Boeing segment, kind of like the one that hit Bloomington. You got the whole thing bowing out right here, and it looks like another Boeing segment off just to my north. Big wind's coming. I'm gonna. What's going on right here? I don't know if the rain shafts are messing with my mind, but... It almost looked like a funnel for a second. Why is my DSLR sitting up there? Gosh darn it, Nathan, get it together. that's the meaning that 
Bibles. Find a country road and pull over and maybe get some uh, perspective. Whoa! Maybe round two. We've got a uh, suggestively shaped mesoscale discussion, as you can see. My dirty mind was wandering when I when it came out. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna head up to uh, Lafayette, in the middle, maybe a little bit north, maybe uh, Brookston. That's a nice flat area, but uh, I can see towers all along to my north and to my west, and they have widened 65 to three lanes up through here. Wow. two ahead of us folks just heading west out of Lafayette on 52 I'm about to cross the Wabash as you can tell because it looks like Bloomington right now uh, once we get past the Wabash the terrain should flatten and this uh, updraft right ahead of me it has wow that was the shortest yellow line I've ever seen um, the updraft dead ahead has gotten significantly wider and significantly darker and this road goes right up to it so it's looking pretty promising. Get back to you guys once I get closer. Just look at it. It's still uh, maturing. So the first uh, chance I get, I'm gonna find a more open area, go south a little bit, and then just wait. Let it come to me. It smells like dirty dirt. I am west of Lafayette right now watching this big old tower to my west exploding before my eyes. You can see a nice little base on it just starting to form off to my west. I'm sitting kind of out ahead of it to give it some time to mature. Maybe it'll uh, produce some pretty clouds. But man, it is humid. Starting to hear some thunder, that's a good sign. Nice small rain free base. Let's see what happens. This might be the uh, this might be the structure of the year right here. <laughs> There's a freaking crazy updraft. Crazy scud underneath. I am gonna get the best photos of my life right here. Huge updraft, huge flanking line. Massive mid-level inflow bands. Not the like most super duper sculpted, but perfect. This is the, the spot to be. drove five miles down the road and then I turn around and then I see this thing. Oh my gosh, perfect field. Low wall cloud, gentle rotation. Oh my god. This is amazing. This storm is amazing.
motion under this thing. <coughs> Not bad, little bit of shear right here. Holy crap! Oh. oh my god, this is the best storm ever. It's just crawling so slow and it's so dynamic and such high contrast in the colors and the sunlight and the rain. I'm gonna get wet. Uh. <laughs> I just can't with the storm. I'm trying to make my way home, but the storm just keeps getting prettier and prettier. Wow. Do it. Frickin' this rotation right on the edge here. It is uh, what? Look at this rotation. Wow. Do it. Plant it. I don't think I've seen a cloud blacker than than what I'm seeing. Wow, that is really ripping. I keep trying to go home, but then the storm keeps doing this. Look at this freaking structure. Oh my gosh. Time to get a time lapse. After a long day's work, it's always worth it, if you're hungry, to get a bean burrito. Bean burrito, 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 Thank you for choosing Taco Bell, it's going to be a 15-20 minute wait for I can take any orders. Okay, I'll just, I'll just leave then.